Melodically, the most striking figure in the chant Unam Peiti is what looks like a throwaway word, honk, which means this. Why would such a word carry such weight? Well, honk is a reverberation of the very first word of the chant, Unam, which means one thing. That is, dwelling in the house of the Lord. In the New Testament, Christ would say to one of his closest friends who had forgotten this, you are concerned about many things one thing is needful. And we too need to remember this honk, this one thing. In this chant, honk is a word of summation, singly standing for the speaker's most ardent desire, which he says is, one thing I have asked of the Lord, this I have sought. It is this which captures all of the speaker, every part of him directed toward the one thing. It's appropriate then that honk melodically spans the whole range of the chant from the very bottom line all the way up over the top of the staff, capturing all of it in a dramatic upward movement, straining toward God, toward God's dwelling place. Falling off of honk is the word requirum, I have sought, whose melisma is echoed in the final two words of the piece, vite me, my life of my life. The string of notes captured in these two words extends out like a span of days, coming to a resting place at the very end on the final of the piece. It's in this true resting place that a life of seeking ends comes to its natural conclusion, living in the Domo Dominus, the house of the Lord, 